Hello, it's Jeanette J Beauty and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm gonna show you how to revive dry hair into nice, soft, smooth, moisturized, healthy hair. I'm starting this treatment on week old hair and I try to stay consistent with that because I wanna make sure I wash my hair pretty much once a week. And you can see how my hair, it's not too dry, but it definitely needs some zhuzhing up. I'm gonna get started right now because I can't have my hair looking like this. First, I'm gonna separate my hair into quadrants, which I always do. It really helps me to manage my hair a lot better overall. And I'm doing this just by using my fingers. It's pretty easy for me to do this. I've pretty much trained my hair to cooperate with me, so suctioning my hair is a breeze. I'm gonna use these plastic clips just to make sure that my hair stays in place. But if you do need some assistance with detangling your hair, I highly recommend to use some warm water. Just spray it right on your hair and also on your scalp and if you need to use an actual detangling spray then do that now that I have my hair in my four sections I'm gonna mist some water on it this is going to help open the cuticle and also water is a moisturizer alone now for my stipple product I'm gonna use the Kokopari coconut milk and I absolutely love this this is very versatile you could use it all over your body especially your hair and this is why I'm using it today you can use it on baby skin it's very soothing and there's a plethora of other benefits just think of it as a beauty and a bottle for your whole body what I'm doing is dividing the quadrant into subsections and then I'm gonna miss some warm water on it this is really going to allow that moisture to get in it so when I do apply my coconut oil it could just penetrate right into my hair strands I do rub it in my hands just to make sure the coconut oil is a little bit more melted so I can work with it better and I'm going to apply it on my hair from roots all the way to the ends really making sure that I do get the ends of my hair because they are the oldest and they definitely need that TLC. I'm going to use a wide tooth comb just to make sure that the coconut oil is distributed in this section very well. And here are a few benefits of coconut oil for the hair that I love. It has the ability to allow the hair to grow longer, thicker, and healthier because of the vitamins and fatty acids in coconut oil. It's going to help nourish your scalp and penetrate the cuticle of the hair. It also adds a luster, shine, and softness to the hair because it's rich in lyric acid. It's easily to penetrate inside the hair strap. Also, it aids in preventing hair breakage and split ends, which I really need. I'm gonna repeat the same process on the rest of my hair, just grabbing small subsections, misting it with water, and applying the coconut oil. And I like to rub the coconut oil in my hands just to liquefy it a little bit so I can apply it to my hair with ease. And look how clumped my curls are. This is a great sign that moisture is being added, and I just love how soft and moisturized my hair feels. It feels so much healthier. I really make sure to get the coconut oil on the ends because it really makes a huge huge difference in the overall integrity of your hair from roots all the way to tips and then I like to twist my hair so you can see the moisture that my hair is holding and we're not even done yet I like to smooth the ends of my hair this just really smooths the cuticle down so that I could twist the ends of my hair and it stays in place it doesn't unravel And now I have two juicy moisturized twists. Just look at this luster and shine. I'm going to twist it up and continue the process. So let me tell you why I love Kokopari because they are 100% organic, vegan, cruelty free, and GMO free. I really love brands that take pride into not only the ingredients but also what they do not have in their products. I really want to reiterate that water is a moisturizer alone, so adding water to your hair is a benefit. It definitely gets that moisture in, but because it's so lightweight, it's not gonna be sufficient on its own. That's why I'm always layering products right on top of the water, because I really want to retain that moisture in my hair. And many oils help to seal that moisture in. Coconut oil is one of my favorite oils because of its many benefits, not only to my hair, but also my skin. And I wanted to show you how the coconut oil applies in this front section because I have low porosity in the front and medium porosity in the back. I will make a dedicated video on this because I get asked this question a lot, but low porosity means it could take a little bit more effort to get that moisture in the hair. 
versus medium porosity in the back, I find that I can easily get moisture in and it stays in pretty well. And now I have two more juicy twists and they feel so good. My hair is definitely moisturized. And now to repeat on the other two quadrants and with the power of editing, I am all done. So look at how juicy my twists still are. They definitely retain that moisture and that's very important. You not only want to get that moisture in, but you want to keep it in. Now this next step, I will be adding heat, but it's totally optional. I just like to do this to intensify the treatment, but you don't have to. You could still get great results without adding heat. And I'm going to add these Cantu Jumbo caps on my head because I'm going to add some heat. I'm going to a few holes in the shower cap for better penetration of the oils when I add heat. I've done this both with holes and without and with holes definitely gets more moisture retained in my hair. And to add indirect heat to my hair, I'm going to use this golden hot soft bonnet hooded dryer and put that right over top of the shower cap and I have been using this for quite some time and I really do enjoy it, especially if I have those last minute styles I need to just you know, put a little bit more heat to help it dry. It does get very hot, so I don't put it all the way on high heat. I will put it on medium heat for 30 minutes. And taking the bonnet off my hair, it feels very warm, but that's a good thing because I can tell the moisture in my hair is so good. I wish you could feel how soft and moisturized my hair was. Whew, it felt so good. Now I'm going to unravel the twist and I still have some definition in my hair, which is also a great sign. I just love doing this treatment overall because it really allows me to detangle my hair. It allows me to prep my hair for shampoo. It's a treatment within itself. It helps with my overall hair and scalp health. My hair looks good. It's a win-win all over. And unraveling the twist from the other side, I'm so happy. I just love my results each and every single time that I do a treatment like this. I'm wrapping my hair up because I will be shampooing, conditioning, and deep conditioning my hair after this. So stay tuned for that video tomorrow. And of course, I had to show you how my hair looks after I rinsed the coconut oil out, but I'm telling you, my hair feels amazing. It's very soft, it's smooth, it is so manageable, a lot healthier for sure. And I'm rinsing with warm water. And here's how my hair looks after I rinse the coconut oil completely out. And I really love how moisturized my hair still is and it still feels nice and soft. I would highly recommend for you to do this treatment if you are experiencing dry hair or if you just want to give some TLC to your hair because we all definitely need it. I hope that you enjoyed my video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.